Hey y'all, this is Rocco. Welcome back to Let's Play Nino Kuni. Wrath of the White Witch. And this is part four. Uh, last time we got my little familiar, my little juggy. And uh, I had to save out here because I was dumb and didn't realize because I was extremely tired and irritated at all of the uh, NPC talk <laughs> last time. That these are actually two different things. I mean, I, I realize they're two different things, but, you know, they look like they're part of the same setup here. So apparently this is for familiars. This is my save stone. So yeah, let's, uh, I'm just gonna save there to test it. Okay. And, um... Yeah, so you actually lose your ability to save your ability to save wherever you want. I guess in certain areas, uh, on the main map, I think you can. But as long as you're in an area like this, uh, you can't do that. So uh, let's check out the let's check out the familiar screen. One other thing, last time I didn't mean to make that video so long, but the thing is. Thing is, I didn't. I misjudged on how long the whole grinding thing would would take up, but I only lost about, if maybe ten minutes of the whole thing uh, by by cutting through the uh, battles. And I have been told that I don't really have to grind, um, except for certain side quests. So I don't know. Whatever, we'll see. I mean, I believe you don't have to grind. I'm not questioning the the truth or anything. I'm just saying, uh, we'll see how I'll how I'll handle it. I like to be uh leveled up because when I was younger, I hated random encounters. I loved playing Final Fantasy two or Japanese four, but I hated random encounters. I just wanted to play the game, so I stopped until I realized eventually that I need to level up and I need to level up now. So I kind of have a thing. I just want to be pretty high level. Right, so last time I learned Healing Touch and Fireball, so it's cool that I have one, uh, you know, one curing spell and one offensive spell. Oh, cool. Here's where I can see how much XP I need to the next level, which wasn't there until I got the... That's funny. I, I'm pretty sure that wasn't there until I got my, um, until I got my Juggy. Look how cute he is there. See, he doesn't look quite as stupid there as he does, like, in the main screen. Oh, cool, and you have rings to equip eventually. Interesting that he gets a shield, and I don't have a shield. I don't need a shield. I'm motherfucker Oliver. Oh, I was trying to find another screen. What was I doing? Uh, recommended. Oh, well, that's cheating, huh? Tricks. Oh, there we go. Cut loose. Oh, I thought that actually meant set free, as in like cut loose from battle, but it says a barrage of random slashes deals physical damage to all enemies. Cool. What is re- Um, I don't want to touch that. Miracle move. Wait, wait, what was that? Miracle move. Slash dance. What a feeling. A blurred barrage of random slashes deals physical damage to all foes. So just like shake your sword and see what happens. Cool. Cool. 
Okay. Miracle move. Burning heat. Heart. Whips up a giant ball of flame, dealing fire damage to a single foe. And that'll burn your heart. I ain't feeding you shit, but at least you're still happy. Choose a familiar to pamper. Okay, I just spent a little time looking through the book, but I spared you the pain of of the extra time consumed by doing so. <laughs> You know, this is actually really awesome that, um, this is almost, I think, it's like one of the first times in a game where the actual characters look like the cutscenes to me. At least mostly. Treasure! Yes. Okay, I'm gonna go back the way the where where I was just to see if there's anything over there to grab. All right, there wasn't anything over there. Nothing new. There was a dead end at the tree. At the Deku Monkey Tree Beard, dude. Old Man Willow. Barb. With spring waterfall. Go to the water. I'd best warn you, Ali boy. It's absolutely crawling with monsters beyond here. <laughs> Careful you don't get got before you even get to the Guardian, eh? I'll be fine, Mr. Drippy. I have a familiar to help me now. There's brave you are. Don't forget, though. If the going gets tough, don't be afraid to cast Healing Touch. I sure won't. And remember what old tree face told you. The spell's menu is a mere tap of square. Away. You should try to familiarize yourself with the main menu too while you're at it. Don't worry, you're not going to break anything, so no matter what you press. And what, did I all of a sudden go on the side from all, no matter what you press? So have a good poke around <laughs> in it. And when you learn new skills and that, new options will come up on the main menu. So keep your eyes peeled and make the most of your new toys. Jeepers! There's so much to remember, and I feel the same way, kid. And we haven't even... We have we've barely grazed the surface here. You'll soon get used to it all, man. No worries. Now, past the whispering waterfalls and onto the guardian of, of the woods we go. Right, let's go help him get back to normal. Alright. Take the opportunity to heal and save. New creek. Up. Oh, what? What? Oh, well, you look friendly. Jabber. Let's go. Beware the Jabberwock. All right, get some practice with the old juggy. Let's try cut loose. Nice. Didn't do shit, but nice. I like you, Juggy. Have to get you up to my level, though. Nope. Bar of chocolate. Now, I think this is what I can feed to him, right? Heaviness. Alright. Oh god, that's ridiculous. 
Stop being so cute, you're gonna make me sound a little... hmm. Well, let's see him get indignant if I just stay on the screen for a second. Yeah, well, he gets immediately happy again. Oh, what happens if I do it to Oliver? Oh, I can't. I can't select him there. Right. Spitu, and we've seen a teeny bopper. Oh, I heard you wanted to live. Too bad. Now we need the MP. You level up, little dude. You leveled up. I like that. Crikey, I knew there was something I forgot to tell you about the familiars. Huh? What's that? This is important, Ali boy, so listen carefully, alright? I showed you how your familiars can use tricks, didn't I? Well, as the little fellows get stronger, they'll start learning new ones. If you want to see what tricks your familiars have up their sleeves, choose friends and familiars from the main menu. Tricks are a bit, <laughs> what, are a bit different from magic. Each individual trick fills a single command slot, you see. Press triangle when you are in the friends and familiars bit, and you can change the command slots used for tricks. Which reminds me, a familiar can only remember a maximum of 8 tricks at any given time, which explains the remove button. Meaning if you want to learn them a new- oh god. Meaning if you want them to learn a new one, you'll have to make them forget one of their old ones. Bit of a pain like, but at least you can teach an old familiar new tricks. Anyway, the important thing is that you assign the trick to your familiar's command wheel. If you don't, you won't be able to use it. Simple as that. Okay, I think I got it. So shut the fuck up. And I'm pretty sure we haven't learned dick yet. Or any more dick. Or wait, what? Yeah. We can do this! I don't know why you were wiping your brow, Oliver. You did nothing. Crunchy carrot, yum yum. Oh god, I hate carrots. Mushy and in soup, they're good. Raw, no. Pretty much the only person I know who doesn't like them that way. Okay, I think I need to... Let's heal a bit. I'm not going to waste any more than that. Alright. Here 
right, he's leveling up pretty quickly. And it. Pretty quickly tidy like. New Monstorb. A whippersnapper. Come on! Here goes! Now I haven't been switching out myself because I really haven't been running out of stamina. I'm also not really paying attention to. Ooh. Blinded me. Aw, oh, shit. Eh, not blind enough. Alright, what does this way take me to? Ah! You thought you could hide this game. Bottle of iced coffee. Yeesh. Oh, was there like eyeballs in there? Oh shit, look at that. Awesome. Alright, that just takes me back around in a loop, but... I don't know. Lots of save spots. Let's test out this little doohickey here. Oh, can't use it, I guess. Not yet, anyway. Udopali boy. Huh? What is it? Listen, man. Someone's coming. But I don't... It's him. It's the flippin' guardian. He's literally flipping down the... Down the path. See? Oh, hey, it's the gubu. Guardian of the Woods. God, that font's awesome. Alright, uh, how are things here? I'm... I'm doing good. So let me step in first. And I'm gonna try out my fireball spell. I do find that interesting that it's sort of turn-based attacks and that I can avoid... N I'm not saying that word. This looks serious, Ali boy. You'd best defend yourself. Alright. You've seen the defend command, ain't it? Use it or you're in for a proper headache, man. Shall do. In f on, on flipping gun. Windfall is usually a good thing. Nice one, Ali boy. There's Tidy. Defending against big moves like that can earn you a nice little bonus as well. So when he starts building up a nasty looking number, be sure to put up your guard. I don't know if I'm getting better or worse, honestly. Let's see what a normal attack does. Just three. Now, I'm going to try to send in a familiar. I've got to defend, I guess. Nah, not good. Alright, let me grab... The, oh, where'd the glim go? Did it disappear? Oh, there's one. Alright, how do I send in uh, L1? Okay. 
and it, I like that. It gives you a little bit of time here to select somebody. We'll bring him in. Let's just do a an attack. See what happens. Three. Oh shit. Oh, I better pick up these glims because I'll be... Damn. Alright, I'm gonna go back in. And actually, I'm gonna eat some of my bread. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Look, early boy. The big lump's only gone and knackered himself. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Now's your chance to give him a proper walloping. Alright, but first I am gonna... Pick up some shit. Oh, did I just lose my, uh... Yeah, I think I lost my chance. Tidy, that's a gold glim. Man, that little beauty will restore all your HP for you. And not only that, it'll also let you do a miracle move that doesn't use any MP. Tidy. But they don't hang around forever. Hurry up and gla grab it, Ollie boy. Trying. Trying. Try. Oh shit. Why isn't it grabbing? Okay, how do I do it? Oh, I just do it. Okay. No other option, pretty much. Yeah. Nice. All right, Guardian, come to your senses now that I've killed you. <sighs> okay, that was a bit of a uh, bit of a test test boss battle. Spirit of the Woods. I'm level 6, and Juggy's already level 5. Wow, Sandblast. Oops. Tree back. Crikey, that was a close run thing, man. The Guardian, he headed towards the deepest part of the wood. Do you think he's back to normal now? Your guess is as good as mine, man. But that weird look in his eyes had gone, at least. I reckon he'll probably take some time out to get his head together. And then it'll be right back to the old Guardianing. But what made him go all screwy like that? You don't think it was... Of course it flippin' was. It was the goddamn drugs. Oh, had Shadar written all over it. We'd best watch our backs if we visit any more forests. Saying that... You get guardians everywhere. <laughs> that was awful. Anyway, we did what we came to do. We'd best get back and see old Tree Face, eh? Sure, let's go. Serenity of the Guardian of the Woods Heart has unlocked the story in the Wizard's Companion. Oh, Christ. We'll check that out later, man. Alright. Hmm. You did well to calm the Guardian of the Woods. And I found what I was looking for. But first, a gift. My way of thanks. Gee. You were on a roll, by yeah, man. I entrust to you one of my closest companions, the Telling Stone. His knowledge of our world rivals even my own. I thought he might help you on your journey. I'm sure if you ask him nicely, he will tell you anything you wish anything? to Anything? And the other thing, the locket. This is what you came here for, is it not? It is a vessel for fragments of the human heart. To rescue the heartbroken, you will need the locket and the spells required to use it. 
I will give you those as well. Thank you so much, old Father Oak. Hmm. Such a well-mannered child. Unlike some, I can hmm. well, I, uh, All right, all right. Ta, Buckface! Hmm. Some things are as unchanging as the forest. No matter. You had best be on your way. Now, boy. You must come and see me from time to time. And tell me of your travels. I look forward to hearing of your progress. Mm hmm Yes, sir. Let's be off, shall we? Time to head back to Ding Dong Dell and mend a broken heart. Okay. Okay. No. Yeah, he gave us a lot of shit in the end, right? Jesus. God damn. A lot of shit in the end. Okay, so for this time, I'm just going to save at the edge of the woods here again. Actually, no, I'm going to go out of the woods and save on the map screen and then call it a game. I think I've been able to keep my promise. I only have a few hours to edit this and and put it back and uh, get it online for me to keep my one video a day promise for today at least. So I shall save. And say thank you for watching. Let's play Nino Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch. This is Rocco. And stay tuned for part five. Thanks. Thank you.